In 1970, a wild and woolly Louisiana Tech quarterback impressed scouts with unpolished skills and a rocket right arm. Terry Bradshaw arrived in Pittsburgh full of starry-eyed rookie intentions. This is the new era of the Steelers. It's not like the old Steelers, believe me. The, the public, uh, the football world might as well wake up and, and just take what I'm saying to, and heed it. Because and as the games come along, as the year progresses, I hope to continually get better. And, uh, and in the future, I hope to be the greatest quarterback that's ever stepped foot on this stadium or any other stadium. But in five NFL seasons, number 12 has experienced some ups and downs. NFL reality taught harsh lessons, and Terry Bradshaw lost some hair, but all that raw talent remained intact, and Chuck Knoll has been patient. For number 12 is still capable of unique feats of strength and daring. Bradshaw can turn near disaster into a 20-yard game, but he also has discovered there are times to feather his touch, as well as times to reach back for that 60-yard screamer. Because of his arm, Bradshaw takes the deepest drop and longest look in football. If he doesn't like what he sees, there's always another option. At 27, Terry Bradshaw is Pittsburgh's all-time leading passer. He's won a world championship and cut a country and western record. But deep down, he's not too far removed from that wild and woolly Louisiana Tech quarterback playing football for the fun of it. Bradshaw will never be called dull, but 1975 brought more consistency. He threw only nine interceptions against 18 touchdown passes to a variety of receivers. With tight ends Larry Brown and Randy Grossman, Bradshaw can work the short game, then go down range to a deep stable of wide receivers. Frank Lewis is a former starter who now splits time because of the success of the 74 draft. Two young receivers arrived and contributed immediately. The sleeper was number 82, John Stallworth from Alabama A&M. Stallworth's first round friend was a hot shot from USC with a reputation as California's finest all around athlete. Number 88, Lynn Swan lived up to his billy. Often, gifted young receivers arrive in the NFL unprepared for the jolt of going over the middle. But Swan was a pro from his first day, willing to go anywhere for a pass. Soon, Pittsburgh fans were singing praises of the young man with a stride and style as graceful as his name. The emerging star became part of an unusual equation. Terry Bradshaw and Lynn Swan made it work 11 times in 75. Unstoppable offense matched immovable defense as the 1975 Steelers won more games, scored more points, and gave up fewer than any team in Pittsburgh history. Next, the NFL playoffs. 